Now, when you're doing experiments in science, you often take repeated readings, and afterwards you then take an average of your results. Now, 99.9% .9 of the time, the average that you're going to be taking in physics is the mean. And the way to work out the mean average, it's just equal to the sum of the numbers divided by the number of numbers. So in this example here, all we need to do is just add up all of these numbers. Again, your calculator comes in really useful for this. And then we divide that by how many numbers we have. In this case, we've got seven of them. And this just gives an answer of 8.314, blah, blah, blah. So in that case, the mean, I'm just going to give it to two significant figures like my data here, is equal to 8.3. That's all there is to it. Pretty straightforward. You probably know it anyway. But that's the main kind of average that we use in GCSE physics.